What's up YouTube, this is Hill Fan. I wanted to do a quick video in response to my last review. If you haven't seen it, it's down below on the Raspberry Pi 400. All I can say is, fanboys, be triggered. Listen, I'm a huge fan of the Raspberry Pi. I've had every single Pi since its drop. I've had multiple versions of those Pis. I've done hundreds of projects on the Raspberry Pi and other platforms and embedded devices like the ESP or Arduino. When the Raspberry Pi dropped, I was really excited that it had an operating system. This is one of the pillars of the Raspberry Pi, in my opinion. It gave us the ability to actually have a GUI to look at it. We could keep it headless, or we had the choice to actually, you know, head towards a desktop replacement. As the Raspberry Pi has grown, we've seen it increase its RAM, increase its processing power, and really head towards a very realistic shot of being a desktop replacement. I don't know why the fanboys hate that. And I don't know why the fanboys would not understand why I'm saying we get a new device and they took away four gigs, thus making it really useless as a desktop computer, even though the form factor screams for it. I don't know why people are critical saying, hey, well, ah, it's not supposed to be that. Well, it looks like that. And by the way, I don't have to overclock my Raspberry Pi 4 8 gig. This, I have to overclock. If we're not ready to admit that the Raspberry Pi Foundation is headed towards the masses, if we're not ready to admit that the Raspberry Pi is actually trying to go towards a desktop replacement, then you're going to be left behind. That's the simple fact of it. No longer is just just for fanboys. This is going to penetrate the market of the masses, and as well it should. Why do we fight something like that when we got the wonderful Raspberry Pi Foundation? It's going to use some of that money to get these devices into the hands of kids around the world that can't afford them. I don't understand why we are afraid of that direction, and I don't understand why fanboys are using Raspberry Pi still when you have things like ESPs that you can do the same things for. We don't need all these resources to do what you are doing. What we need the resources for is for a desktop replacement that's inexpensive and we can get it in the hands of everybody. I'm not afraid of that movement and I don't think you should be either. For those who subscribed, I appreciate it. For those who hated, I appreciate it too. It's not going to stop me. I'm not here to make money. There will be no monetization of this channel. There will be no affiliate links in the bottom. All you will get out of me is honest and real views. You will also see things like what I do outside, snowboard, fly fish, and my adventures. But I love technology, and I'll continue to do these no matter what the fanboys think. I appreciate anybody who's watching, and I mostly appreciate you who subscribed. I look forward to getting to know all y'all. Let's get it.